This is day four of the trip, and I'm about 50 miles southeast, south of uh, Seattle, and uh, traffic is really good because it's the day after the 4th of July, and a lot of people took the day off. Well, here I go driving into Seattle. You can see the big, beautiful buildings in the background, and uh, just saw a sign that said, uh, park, uh, park ahead called Pike Place and I uh, also saw another one that was uh, I don't know if it was a street but it was Colombian so uh, Seattle loves their coffee as do I. Well I'm getting close to Tom's house I'm going to be taking exit 246 and uh, sure nice to have my uh, <laughs> have my cell phone it tells me where to go um, but it's not too far away, and we'll be seeing Brother Tom. Well, I'm feeling pretty good today. I shaved, I showered, I haven't brushed my teeth yet, but I'll get around to it. It's only 8 o'clock, so uh, that's it. Okay, this is U Street. I forgot to turn my blinker on. <laughs> In a quarter mile, turn left onto South Hills Drive. He lives in the jungle. Two tenths of a mile. Oh boy. Okay. In 800 feet, your destination will be on the right. Yeah, people want to know where Tom lives, what it's like. Uh, so that's what this video is for. 450 feet. I know he lives on a corner. This is a nice looking neighborhood. Your destination is on the right. Hey, I got my own parking spot here. There's Tommy's house. You used to ride your horse. Yeah, you brought your horse over here years ago. Huh. Very long Where did is there a place to park your trailer and you get out? Yeah, right over behind us. So oh, park okay. out over there, and you just ride down the trail up into the hills. Tom gets camera shy. Yeah, the dock. Are we gonna are we gonna sit on the dock all no. day? Oh, what's the song go? Sitting on the dock of the bay, wasting time, watching the tide roll away. Sitting on the dock all day, wasting time. Okay, give me some background music, Tom. Huh? Do 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 do. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, we're out on the dock. Check it out. Isn't it beautiful? I'm going to give you a letter and you give me a verse, okay? You ready? Right. D. Draw near to me and I will draw and God will draw near to you. Um, R. Oh, rest in the Lord and wait patiently for him. That's the trail we went last time. G. G. Uh, God so loved the world, He gave His only begotten Son. That whoever believe in Him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Um, T. The blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all sin. That's so good, huh? That how, that take you a long time to memorize all this? It took a little while. Yeah. I need to do that. You've inspired me. Okay. You're an, <laughs> you're an inspiration to your. Give me more. I like it. I like the test. <laughs> Okay, uh, B. B. Behold the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. Who said that? John the Baptist. Okay. Z. Zealous for good works. <laughs> That's great. Okay, we're like on the last leg of the trail here. 
pretty well, much. We're going a long way to go. Oh. <laughs> okay. So, what are we having for breakfast? Yule? Yule Gibbons? Gibbons? Eggs, eggs and toast. Oh, uh, no, I can't eat eggs and toast. Guess I could eat eggs. But then I'm going to go, I'm, I'm flexing on my diet. I don't want to cheat my diet. Oh, eggs are perfect for the diet. Eggs are awesome. Yeah, but it's not what I, it's not my plan, Stan. Tom. Yeah. N. Uh, N. Oh, Rick, I wasn't thinking about that. Uh, okay, now is the accepted time. Behold, now is the day of salvation. <laughs> um, C. Come to me, all ye who oh, labor weary. and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Okay. My yoke is easy and my burden is light. Wow. It's good to memorize scripture because it, uh, it goes with you wherever you go. Yes, it does. And uh, keeps you on the, on the straight and narrow. See how straight this is right now? You still got to stay straight on the narrow. Uh, so I'm going to ask you for some spiritual advice here, Tom. Yes. <laughs> so when, when God says no, <laughs> what should you do? <laughs> Should you listen or do do what you want to do? You listen. <laughs> listen and always obey. Listen. Trust and obey. Why? Why should we? Why should we do that? Because he knows the beginning to the end. He knows yeah. your choices are wrong, and you'll suffer for him. Yeah. And he's a lot smarter than we are, huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> Especially a lot smarter than you. <laughs> okay. Well, we just left Tom's house and we are going to, what do you call it, Chuckanut? Chuckanut Drive. Chuckanut Drive. And what's it all, what's the story behind it? <laughs> it's a expensive homes? Yeah, there's expensive homes look, overlooking the, uh, the the bay and the, uh, and the islands, San Juan Islands. Okay, and it's uh, just a few miles from here? Yes, not that far. Yeah. Okay. You're looking at Puget Sound and uh, the San Juan Islands. This isn't Sun Valley? No, no, no. We used to go. Mm, I could smell. Yeah, this Sudden Valley is just a beautiful place. You could see those apartments or condos and then a beautiful golf course. And it's backed up on uh, uh, Lake Whatcom. And uh, pretty cool place. I think a lot of people love to live there, including me. And Tom Thompson, he's a wonderful brother. Amen. <laughs>